locker room. You gotta work with this. You know, it's do or die now. You know, win or you go home, basically. So I definitely think our backs is up against the wall, just like everyone else. But um, we respond well when we're in situations. I think you said at some point that, that, that maybe the lights and the number one ranking and all of that stuff kind of got in your guys' face and it was rough to handle. Does it help now that you guys are a little bit? In the, the shadows, and people don't look at you the same way. You're not a number one seed. You're not really out there. The same yeah, I way. think so. Uh, like you said, we're not really out there. You know, we're not getting the amount of exposure we were at the beginning of the year. So, I definitely think you know a lot of people uh, have have us in their brackets as um, you know a team that can get upset. And, uh, I think that's motivated mo- motivation to us. And, uh, I think we'll use that to our our advantage. You said after the loss today that you guys had to regroup again. You got to get back to. The basics. I mean, you said that multiple times. Are you at the point where you're kind of tired of getting to that that statement after after losses? Well, yeah, it was, it's the time of season now where we have to, um, you know, learn. We have to have learned from all of our mistakes and um, things we've done in our losses. So I think this team um, has matured a lot since the beginning of the year, and I think we're we're we're, we're ready to uh, make a run. We're ready to you know go after our our goal that we've set since day one. What do you say to people who question your Toughness as a team. Um, just say that you know. I don't know really. I just. I don't you feel really, like you guys are tough. Yeah, I think we're tough. I think um, we're young, but I think we're tough, and we show flashes of being tough. You know, it's been games where we we wouldn't have won if we weren't tough. The Michigan State game at home, Ohio State game at home. You don't win those games if you're not tough, flat out. Um, I definitely think this team is tough. Uh, there's times where you may see uh, us trying not to foul as much and things like that, and people may, you know, miss miss mistake that for us being soft. But I think this, def- this team has definitely matured a lot since the beginning of the year. And we're, you know, we're doing a really good job of just staying in the moment. And, you know, that's what that's all that matters. The way the way last season ended, does that you guys know the disappointment of the first round loss that you Yeah, does that do for you now? it motivates us. Um, like I said, we know what it feels like. That feeling hurts very bad. Just knowing that we got a lot of seniors in this team as well. We did last year, so um, I think that's something that will be in the back of our head. You know, we obviously not going there trying not to lose, but you know, we know we don't want to, you know, feel that way after a loss. We know we're not trying to go home. Anyway, so we're going to do what we need to do this week to get ready for uh, South Dakota State. How do you we, fix? We, 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 we always say this could be your last run. What is your general response to? If it is your, because you looked at it last year, we all assume mm-hmm. it's happening this year. Well, that's just, um, that's something I'm really not thinking about. Right now. It's something that I'll definitely uh, look at after a year and you know talk it over with my coaches and you know uh, my family and things like that. But right now, you know, we're on a mission. We're all on a mission. And I'm not thinking about that right now. So. How do you get? You guys have started slow. So, how do you, in an NCAA tournament situation, you do that and there's a good chance that you're done. Yeah. How do you overcome doing that, especially with young Well, players? just our, just reminding them that our back is against the wall now. And, you know, teams are just as hungry as we are. Teams are trying to get where we're trying to get. And, uh, and we'll get beat if we come out that way. So I think the sense of urgency will definitely raise from this point forward. And, um, I think you will see a team that, you know, that you've seen similar to the beginning of the year, preseason MIT. You know, a team that, you know, have fun out there on the court. Why do you think it hasn't been happening? Uh, well, the Big Ten is a, <laughs> it's a crazy conference. And um, you're not going – every night you're just not going to come out with the same amount of urgency regardless of how how hard you're trying to. You know, teams, are, teams scout you so well in this conference. And, um, just to be able to get away from the conference for, you know, a while um, and play against a team that you're not as familiar with, that may be uh, to our advantage. So I think you'll see it, um, you know, a sense of urgency, like I said, that you've seen at the beginning of the year. Do you feel like you guys are tired?